Hey, what's up, guys? Geography here. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a Minecraft server on Linux. Um, actually, I have Windows, and uh, yeah, and actually, VirtualBox is trash, so I will show you how to enable Linux on Windows. Uh, and just go to settings and apps and programs and features and uh, turn windows feature on or off and scroll all the way to down and you can see windows subsystem for linux and in default it will be off you need to tick it and click ok and just close everything and then go to microsoft store and search ubuntu not only ubuntu you can just search any uh, 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 Linux OS after enabling that and yeah and I already installed Ubuntu 18.04 Ubuntu I resetted it now so it will be from the beginning so it will help you guys and it's installing let's wait for it to install Okay guys, while it's installing, uh, let's go to packetmine.net and just click get packetmine and click next and uh, it sh is the uh, your it should be the minimum requirement for packetmine server and your yeah, 64 bit CPU, 64 bit operating system and one gigabyte ram and dual core processor and um, yeah mm. uh, my cpu has way more than that uh, i have six, 16 gigabyte of ram and uh, 64 with the operating system and i believe it is 4 core and a thread and yeah uh, and click next and uh, that is a minimum requirement and your uh, server should have that and yeah I will tell you why that recommend and there's a two uh, option like C URL and wget uh, wget definitely will work because it is a uh, uh, only way to download files in Linux and C URL is uh, also you should to download but it is you have to install it if you want to use it so just uh, use wget and yeah, copy and yeah now it works uh, I mean installed let's type the username and password and yeah now we actually uh, have a Linux and if you are already having a Linux operating system now you can continue the uh, steps and yeah if you have um, if you have Linux in Google Cloud platform or any other cloud hosting you can follow this step same step first we need to create a directory mkdir is user to create a directory and let's name it as packet miner and you can name it as whatever you want uh, and let's create a directory called packet mine and let's see due to the directory And now we are in the packet mine and I'm gonna use wget uh, command and I click copy and hit enter it will start downloading the necessary files okay now it's downloading the it's clean it's cleaning the directory it will 
delete all the files in the directory which is packet main we, we created now only but if you have a, a directory with um, some files it will completely erase those files so you make sure you create a directory then it will start downloading the files it now it's downloading the packet mine then it will download the in third step it will download php version 7.3 yeah now it's downloading php version 7.3 oh once it's installed um we need to um once it's downloaded we need to install the i mean kind of create the create it and if you guys know the time i am re-recording this part uh because my microphone did not work uh last time at this spot i tried a uh, voice overlay but uh it is not actually came good so i'm re-recording it in the middle of editing yeah so let's uh and another thing if this this time also my obs fail then i will not record this video anymore and let's hit enter and the language um actually um this is uh, and you can see the um bracket the thing is in the bracket is default so if you do not want default you have to like select the language and uh, type here uh if uh, if english is default so we need to type we don't need to type anything so i'm just gonna hit enter then do you accept the license we have to accept the license even it is uh it is in general public license still we need to accept the license i don't know why and do you want to skip the setup wizard no we don't want to skip the setup wizard the ns caps means uh no is default packet mine so server name i'm gonna name it as no let's keep it default the packet mine server is default you can name whatever you want and i'm gonna hit enter and port is to default and game mode default max player default and max player is according to your server specification uh, if your server is uh, is low end then you cannot have like 100 people playing on the server at the same time like that's why uh, you need to uh, uh, alter the max player according to your server specification and okay hopefully it is working and enable spawn protection yes default and game or uh, in-game name or uh, my in-game name is uh, and do you want to enable right this now uh do you want to disable query i don't know what it is uh query is a protocol used to do, uh, by different tool to get information of your server player law uh, and players logged in if you disable it you won't be able to use server list uh i don't understand uh let's just keep it as default and archon archon is a important thing uh so yes we have to enable it and my external ip uh if you track it it will show my isp location so you cannot actually uh i mean not uh isp my mobile network uh, provider I mean their location and my location is more than 200 kilometers away from their location so yeah i'm publicly showing my external ip and internal ip um okay and make sure if you are uh, i'm not gonna port forward its server because um i'm just gonna this is just for recording so if you want to make your server online and make other people from players from ac across the world you want to make your server international then you have to make put forward your server uh, if you are using a google cloud platform and any other cloud hosting you just need to put forward it to use it let's hit enter i am not going to put forward it and i don't have a router that is also a reason i cannot put forward it 
so I'm just gonna hit enter you are finished now the server will start and hopefully audio is recording yes and server is started let's open minecraft so and okay uh, it is my internal IP address and um, uh, you guys can see that my server is running and I'm just gonna hop on change skin and confirm and join joining the server and that's me I'm just gonna make it like this okay spawn is actually pretty good and I'm operator so um, here is your server you can create a lobby and do uh, anything you want and uh, I will not print this video right now because uh, people will have a question how can I install plugins using terminal and uh, how to install plugins after download how to install plugins and yeah I will show it right now and let's uh, go to our browser and go to the go to the this uh, I mean I mean not this uh, this site the packet mine uh, plugin site I guess uh, yeah uh, here's uh, there are so many latest version working plugins so you can download it and you don't have any other out outdated or uh, older plugins it will have only latest plugins so I recommend using this site and right click copy link location and now the server is running so we cannot uh, I want to install my plugin but I don't want to stop my server so I need to create another uh, terminal uh, so we are in another terminal cd packet mine packet mine and hopefully audio okay uh, okay guys so, sorry for that but I don't want to lose my audio so I am just checking constantly so ls and uh, cd to plugins directory and you need to type a command called w get and you are the you have to right click here and copy that that link and you have to paste the link and hit enter it will connect to the server and use the get meta to get the plugin okay now we downloaded the plugin uh, now your server have uh, hundreds of players playing at the time so you do not want your server to uh, uh, you do not want your server to stop and you want to the players to stay uh, playing uh, while it's while you install the plugin so you don't need to do anything just type reload the server is re re reloading at the same time players can play the play in the server so the reload is completed and I did not uh, the server did not stop we are still on the server okay now uh, yeah so you guys can see that uh, the reload thing and uh, so now I'm just gonna type uh, worlds. The plugin, the plugin now I installed is multiple world uh, plugin. You can create a multiple worlds. So I'm gonna create another world and create a sky wars. Let's sky wars and flat. And hit enter. The world is created. You, there is a shortcut you don't want to type worlds there is a ws uh, uh, list list and yeah you guys can see that there is a uh, multiple worlds uh, alright now let's go to that world instead of playing here slash tp oh slash tp -S -K -Y -W -A -R -S, sky wars and yeah 
uh, this or the chunk that already loaded on that world we are, we are, it will show uh, slowly replace with this world chunk uh, so yeah so yeah mm. Oh, now only I know <laughs> we can fly <laughs> in survival mode. Uh, what is this kind of weird pattern? So, okay, let's uh, talk about it later. I don't know what is this. Oh, is that a kind of different biomes? I don't know, guys. Let's <coughs> okay, let's TP back to our main world. Okay, we are on the main world and chunk will slowly re replace with this world chunk and yeah so okay and uh, so uh, I will show there is uh, something is not actually a problem uh, but uh, people don't know how to do that so I'm gonna just stop my server okay I stopped my server now I just gonna restart my server and the server is started and <coughs> now I'm gonna join a server uh, so uh, we are on our server and uh, yeah let's do ws or uh, tp sky waRS and you guys can see it uh, the wor world sky wars is not loaded or does not exist or uh, yeah uh, you don't need to freak out uh, if you saw this you just need to do slash ws LOAD load skywars and once it loaded you can go to the world yeah wait oh, I can't fly just now I fly so okay and yeah uh, hopefully the audio is recording yes it's recording and yeah so if you guys like this video smash the like button if you guys find this video helpful make sure to subscribe to my channel and i'm planning on doing a series on how to make a server with lobby or uh, sky wars sky blocks and uh, prison server and more and smp survival multiplayer yeah uh, I'm gonna make a video on how to do that so I'm gonna make a series on how to do that so make sure to subscribe and turn on all notification so thanks for watching bye guys